Hey guys, now we are going to discuss about how to install JFrog using Docker image. Docker image means JFrog as a Docker image, then how to run as a artifact, JFrog artifact, JFrog artifact application, how we are going to deploy through Docker. Okay. Before that, what we should do, we should be get the we should download from the images like as there is a different image and then there is a OSS flavor and this remember guys this J artifactory guys right this is artifactory from JFrog is artifactory and now this we are storing for the different kind all all kind of uh, packages where it's like as SBT, AVA and like as the Docker, uh, Maven everything everything we can able to store the all artifacts here now for this, what we'll do, this is two flavors under OSS and Pro. OSS is not giving the all the features. They will give the small, like as three, four uh, repositories, they will be enabled. If you go Pro, they will give the all the repositories. What do you buy? They will give that. But now the Pro also we can able to do within 15, 15 days trial period, they will give and license key we need to upload. If you're the OSS person, it will be, they won't do all the repositories and we can able to install, like as whatever we require that we can do that. I will show the OSS and even if you guys like pro or both are same but this if you use the pro you need to register the that website and they will send you one uh, key for you through mail and that key we need to copy and paste into your this artifact whenever it asked okay now basically I already downloaded the images check that docker images are there or not okay jfrog like as this is okay docker binary jfrog artifact pro Okay, and also OSS version, and this is a CPP, it's not required. This C C uh, programming purpose. Let's me re remove this space, it's not wasted. Okay. RMI. It's not required. Okay, let's remove. Right? How you download? Just go to the JFrog documentation. Yes, I will show that. JFrog. Docker images. Okay, fine. It will do. Okay. And then make sure and very properly need to be run. This is okay. You should be definitely use the volumes. Okay. Right? Okay. And how to pull? This is the pro version pulling and OSS version pulling and CPP version pulling. Then go through like this. How to run and all. Even volumes and also they will give okay and how to run how to use this they will give it. and if you are using any extra java in one variables you can use and supported in one variables also they give the complete list of here okay here with volumes how we are going to run this is the way we are going to be the complete thing right clear fine now let's run this one now okay then if you want to download anything this is for docker installation how to install them because of let me check i have the docker already in my system right that's why i don't need to install the docker if you're not there docker you should be install the docker in your mission then only you can do this okay that's a recommended to install the software okay then after downloading this docker pull these images which was which flavor you want that flavor and just run the flavor okay OSS or anything just I'm making the OSS running here that run at an infinite mod factory both the same right is if you want to pro run they can run this just that image name we need to change okay. if you want to OSS version just run it okay run it then see the docker ps okay now this is for L this is see healthy right now it's came at the earlier it was running earlier right now it's came at healthy starting that time it's showing the starting right this is a flash framework it's showing healthy in brackets okay fine now this is ours one 8081 right let me allow this port number 8081 in our i think i allowed or not i definitely i allow because of so this is i took purpose that is only if it's not allowed, we should be allowed at the edge rate one. Yeah, it's already there now. Just go there instances. Take the instance. And then 
give it and then do the edge zero edge one. Okay, very simple, right? Very very simple. No need to extract, no need to make it surveys, no need to running like this, like this. This takes time. And if you want to see uh, this last, just check the what's going on exactly. Docker logs and then container ID. Which one? This container ID. Okay. This is the thing. This artifact tree successfully started. Okay. This is the way we are going. Let's take time to effect fish. And guys, this is for work in the micro instances. Okay, you should be take the medium instance minimum. Okay, minimum is a chargeable again. Okay, AWS, I took the medium instance here. T2 medium. Okay, micro, it won't start it up running. When, when you run this one, then your dark mode will stop to work. Okay, fine. Let's see now. Come on. Sure, come man. Any error came? Just one second. is ready now go to tour for this if you want to go to and if you want to create your username password just make it your username password okay now admin admin object of one two three so okay, if you want using any proxy and all, proxy server and skip this one then see gradle ivl maven jsbt this is the and generic this is a way they will give free if you want to use that chef condom conduct grand debate docker gems and these things go and anything anything you want to store as a art factory no we need to buy this it's not a free okay this is a pro version will give the all this pro version will give the all this Clear? That's the reason. Now these are the only we can able to do. Okay, and then skip, finish it. Done. Okay. Now if you wanna create anything, go to this home. All the settings and whatever the browsers are there, what are the users are there, everything can go to there. Okay, remote location repositories. Okay, how many artifacts are served till now and all everything in the form of give that information? Clear? Even you can manage this into this CLI also. Okay, there's a lot of documentation for this. Even this JFrog document is a very nice documentation. Just go through that documentation if you need. Okay. Clear. If you want to create, you can create this as an objects and go to setup me and create for the setup. This is for this is for general. It's general. This is general artifact. Plus 
oxytocin no? and we'll see that in if you need to pro and all right in the further i'm going to uh, push the main documents for that jay from and those also we are going to see maven how to push maven artifact to jay from how to push dagger image to jay from we'll see the further classes okay and when uh, dagger you should be installed okay and if you don't like how to install that not in previous videos we have right that's we can take a reference on this okay fine that's it guys any questions it's a simple on command right <laughs> nothing okay guys thank you